Earlier this year, there was a lot of curiosity over the launch of Boeing's astronaut-carrying craft Starliner. It was delayed by years and there have been multiple launch cancellations owing to technical issues. Now Starliner has spent 20 days in space. In fact, it has overstayed by more than 10 days. But the big question is, when will Starliner return to Earth with its two astronauts? And can Starliner return safely? In this report, we'll tell you all about the Starliner saga. Take a look. American aerospace giant Boeing is facing its worst yet crisis. In recent years, Boeing's fleet of 737 MAX series planes have been hit by safety issues, with two fatal crashes and parts falling off mid-flight, flying on Boeing 737 planes has become fearsome. On many occasions, Boeing 737 aircraft passengers experience sudden severe discomfort, including stinging sensation in the ears and nosebleeds. All these are attributed to Boeing's compromises in manufacturing and safety standards. Amid such testing times, Boeing test launched its new spacecraft Starliner. Starliner is Boeing's astronaut ferry. It's meant to carry NASA crew to the International Space Station and return them safely. Two veteran American astronauts and former U.S. Navy test pilots, Butch Wilmore and Sunita Williams, have undertaken this journey. But so far, things haven't been going smoothly. NASA and Boeing approved Starliner's maiden launch, knowing fully well that there was a helium gas leak. On June 5th, Starliner nestled atop the Atlas V rocket, lifted off and headed towards space. While traveling in space, Starliner developed more helium leaks. Soon after, Starliner could not fire five of its 28 thrusters, which steer the craft in space. Despite this, Starliner safely reached the space station with an hour's delay. Astronauts Wilmore and Williams have spent more than 20 days on the space station. They were supposed to return within a week or so. And here we are on the 25th of June, and their return has been delayed indefinitely. The delay is caused by ongoing issues with the Starliner craft. Astronauts routinely live and work on the space station for as long as six months. But the issue here is about the repeated delays and Boeing's reputation that's hit rock bottom. And most importantly, Starliner is only rated for a 45-day mission. This means they must return before the third week of July. Boeing and NASA have been confident. They maintain that the delays are helping them study the Starliner craft, its data and the associated technical issues. However, if the need arises and if at all Starliner is deemed unfit to return to Earth, what are the alternatives? It would be Boeing's worst nightmare. Boeing would have to depend on Elon Musk's SpaceX. SpaceX has been operating their own astronaut ferry crew, Dragon. Over the last four years, Dragon has ferried astronauts to and from the space station in multiple trips. And if all options fail, Boeing will have to seek their competitor SpaceX's help to return the astronauts safely. Here's the irony of the situation. NASA had chosen both Boeing and SpaceX to design and build astronaut ferries. SpaceX took the lead and mastered this technology. Boeing delayed Starliner for many years, spent much more than the projected budget, and even now don't have a reliable solution. By all means, it appears that Sunita Williams and Butch Wilmore will get back home only by July. With Siddharth MP, Bureau Report, we on World This One. To stay up to speed with the latest news, download the We on app and subscribe to our YouTube channel.